you know me, guys. I've got a film for us to watch. Oh, uh, not another one of those. Hey, these films were good enough for me. They're good enough for you kids. All right. All right. Hi, I'm Chuck Sampsonite, here to talk to you on behalf of the Computing Technology Industry Association on computer etiquette. Now, today's computers are absolute miracles, capable of thousands of calculations per second and as small as ice boxes. But that doesn't mean they can repair themselves. Nope, today's computer repairman needs to be not only a smart fella, but he also needs to have the sensitivity to work within the office environment. Let's watch this short film on computer technician etiquette. Is this machine 8675309? Yes, it is. Move. What a rude IT technician. That's right, Jenny. Dennis was one rude fella. You should always treat your clients with respect. Let's let Dennis try it again the right way. Yeah, I'm just at work today. I've got so much to do. I'm like, oh, I've got to go. I'll talk to you later. Bye. Hi, I'm Dennis from IT. Hi, Dennis. Is this machine 8675309? Yes, it is. Well, would now be a good time to work on it? Just one moment. Let me close out of a document. Great. What a swell IT technician. Good job, Dennis. A pleasant introduction always gets things started on the right track. You know, around every person's computer is all kinds of personal equipment. Telephones, tape, pencils. Every good IT tech should ask permission before using any of these clients' personal property. Let's see an example of this done erroneously. What a rude IT technician. Faux shizzle, Jenny. Dennis was rude and inconsiderate. Let's give Dennis another chance to do it, this time the right way. Would it be okay if I used the phone? Why, of course. Great, thank you. What a swell IT technician. Good job, Dennis. Next subject, personal phone calls. Let's see how a rude IT tech would handle this situation. So no matter what I do, my computer keeps rebooting, and I try to... Uh, uh -huh, I, uh -huh. And then I try to get into this document, and yeah. it reboots no matter what I do. It goes mm -hmm. off and on and off and on, and... <gasps> what a rude IT technician. You're right, Jenny. No IT tech worthy of his anti-static wristband would ever treat a user like that. Let's let a true IT tech show us how it's done. This is a personal call. I'll take it later. What a swell IT technician. Atta boy, Dennis. You know where your priorities lie. The customer always comes first. But sometimes, important phone calls come in, phone calls you've got to take. In that case, what do we do? This is a really important call. Is it okay if I take it? Sure, go ahead. Great, I'll be right back. Thank you. What a swell IT technician. Indeed, Dennis is swell. Our next subject, private information. At times, it's hard to avoid. But let's see how a disobedient IT tech would handle such a situation. It can be very tempting to take a harmless peek at private information. Always keep your eyes where they need to be, on your job. Shame on you, Dennis. Should we give him another chance? Oh, okay. Nope. Dennis is having none of that. He keeps his eyes on his work. Totally redeemed, Dennis. Let's see how the world of IT etiquette handles little children. Let's see bad Dennis handle a sensitive situation. Um, I've got to go make some jello. I'll just be down the hall chopping some carrots. You don't mind if Timmy stays here, do you? No, no, that, that's okay. What does this key do? When I push this key, hey, what hey, happens? Hey, please don't do that. Okay. Trying to work. I'm climbing Mount Technician. Beam me kid, up, Scotty. Cool it. Okay. I'm 
better. No, I'm better. I'm better. I'm better. Timmy! What a rude IT technician. Inappropriate, Dennis. A good IT tech always treats everybody with respect. Let's see how it should be done. I'm better. No, I'm better. I'm better. I'm better. I'm better. Ma'am? Yes? Although precious and adorable, it's very distracting to work with your child here. Could you please have it removed? Why, yes, of course. What a swell IT technician. Timmy knows quality work when he sees it, but any refined IT tech would know our next subject, documentation. A good IT tech would always document his work, keeping records that can make that good IT tech a great IT tech. Dennis, are you a great IT tech? You betcha. In the world of computers, an IT tech may come across illegal material. How would Dennis handle such a serious predicament? Yeah, boss. Yeah, it's Dennis. No, I think I better get down here today. 675309. All kinds of bad stuff on this machine. Yeah, it's pretty serious. No, I'll wait here. Good job, Dennis. He reported the illegal activity to his superior, letting the powers that be handle this situation according to the rules and regulations. Ma'am, you're coming with me. <gasps> what a swell IT technician. <laughs> Dennis, you are a great IT technician. Our next subject, customer service. Each customer understands computers differently and should be treated with dignity. How would bad Dennis handle the customer? All right, I'm out of here. Wait, but, but, uh, what a rude IT technician. He was rude, Jenny. He should have made himself available to educate you on your PC problems. Let's see it done right. Great. Well, I think it's all working here. Why don't you sit down and give it a try and see how it works for you? It works perfectly. Perfect. I'm going to go now. Why don't you, you give me a call if this problem comes back? Thank you, Dennis. You're welcome. What a swell IT technician. Swell? He's the best IT technician ever. Great job, Dennis. Let's let Dennis be your guide throughout the world of IT etiquette. Wow, riveting. I don't know about you, but I've learned a lot about computer technician etiquette. Go ahead and pause the tape now, or continue to Unit 47. Pretty inspirational, huh, kids? Yep. You bet. Well, you should be inspired, because what you're going to be seeing on the a are all of those individual steps. There's a number of questions that deal directly with each of those, so make sure you take some time and memorize those, okay? All right. Sounds good.